the history of the Jews, which is very interesting and also very controversial. And I thought I'd go and have a look at Jewish literature to see what they say about their origins. And here we see three quotes. And the first is in the 1925 Jewish Encyclopedia, which says that Esau, Edom, is modern Jewry. And of course, this is contrary to what most people believe today, which is that the Jews are God's chosen people because they are the Israelites. But here, the Jewish literature is saying that they are actually from the tribe of Edom, not the tribe of Israel. And in the Jewish Almanac in 1980, it says, strictly speaking, it is incorrect to call an ancient Israelite a Jew or to call a contemporary Jew an Israelite or Hebrew. And that's because, truthfully speaking, they're not the Hebrews or Israelites, they are really the Edomites. And also, we see here in the Encyclopedia Judaica that Edomite Jews began to call themselves Hebrews and Israelites in 1860. And so, this is a relatively new idea that the Jews are God's chosen people, and that they are the Israelites. And so, let's have a look now at the first word of Jew that's appearing in the Old Testament. And to do that, I thought we're going to have a look at the Strong's Exhaustive Concordance of the Christian Bible. And so, we see here the Strong's Exhaustive Concordance of the Bible. And if we look at the word Jew, we see here that the word actually begins in the book of Ezra in the Old Testament and the reference there is 3064 and so here in the Hebrew and Chaldee Dictionary of the Old Testament when we look at 3064 we see it means Jehudi or someone from Judah in other words a geographical word and if we go back and have a look at the New Testament reference you see the New Testament reference there is 2453 and so if we're going to have a look at the word Jew in the New Testament, it's been translated from the word Eudaios, which is where the word Jew comes from. The words I-O-U today are J-E-W. It actually means someone belonging to Judea, or someone from the physical geographical location of Judea. And so the word Jew is derived from a geographical term referring to the land of Judea. And remember that the Judeans were only one of the 12 tribes of Israel, 